right folks welcome to my channel so you got a download folder has a lot of files in it it has jpegs pngs text files pdfs executables the apps you downloaded there's so much stuff is and you wish there was a way that you could automatically send those files to different locations and organize it and it will become easier for, for you to find the files in it there is a way of doing that easily and automizing your all your files going into different folders from your download folder basically you can very easily declutter your download folder using a small app called automator provided by apple itself in your imac so let me show you how you can do that okay welcome to my imac so we're going to launch onto automator by using the uh, spotlight search so launch this spotlight search all you have to do is command and space and this comes out type automator here you are just type three letters and it's launched see automator is launched file new will give us option to create a new workflow there are multiple uh, options available to us to create workflows uh, we can create a small application or quick action or print plugin, calendar alarms, lots, lots of and lots of things you can do here. Today we are going to create a folder action. What we want to do is we want image files as they arrive in the download folder automatically move to external drive uh, and a separate folder. That will give us better uh, options or better way of organizing our files. So we're going to choose the folder options. We come to this screen. We're going to choose the file and folders here. And we are going to take the find folder items and choose download because that's where we want the action to happen. Not the documents, downloads. And we want kind what kind of the files image files we want to find we want the file we want the workflow to find all the image files what we want next is we want it to move to an external hard drive so we're going to move it to crucial and downloads you will see the files appear here click choose and again there are two actions in here to keep the movie short i'm just doing it for the image files you can add more actions you can right click and duplicate and add more actions to it but uh, just we're going to do it for image files today and now we're going to save it we're going to call it images to crucial Crucial drive. I'm going to save it and it's been saved. Now we are going to test our workflow. We're going to click run and you see all green check marks. That means it works perfectly. Okay, now let's go and check, save it and exit from here and go to the finder and have a look at our download folder. See, all the image files have been disappeared. Now, in the future, anytime you download an image file, it will arrive here, but then immediately it will move to your external hard drive under the download folders. You see, all appear here. Now, let's say down the road, you decide this workflow not to happen every time the image file arrives. What you do now? Okay, so you go into the finder. Macintosh, you can click on a Macintosh. This is your local, uh, this is your local computer's hard drive. You can click users, your name, and download folder. Right click, services, folder action setups, run service. And you see our service has been attached to this download files, which is telling it to uh, what to do. You can open it up by clicking edit and see what's happening there. Or you can click on the minus to get rid of this action for future. 
So folks, now you know how to declutter your download folder. Okay, hope this video was helpful. If you find it valuable, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe for my future videos. All right, see you next time. Bye for now.